We're going to explain how to decrypt an SD card that was encrypted on a different phone. This can be tricky because the decryption process depends entirely on how the encryption was initially set up and what operating system the original phone used. There's no universal solution, but we can cover the most common scenarios and troubleshooting steps. 1. Identify the encryption type. The first crucial step is figuring out what kind of encryption was used. This isn't always obvious. Look for clues on the original phone's settings if you still have access. Android phones often use file-based encryption, which means the entire SD card is encrypted, while others might use a full disk encryption method. iOS devices usually handle encryption differently, often integrating it with the device's overall security. If the SD card was encrypted by a third-party app, you'll need to figure out which one. 2. Trying the original phone. If you still have access to the original phone, this is the easiest route. Simply insert the SD card back into that phone. If the phone recognizes the encryption and you know the password or PIN, the decryption will happen automatically. If not, you may need to look for the encryption app settings to try resetting or disabling the encryption. Warned, resetting could erase data. 3. Using a third-party decryption tool. This is risky and not recommended unless you're absolutely sure of the tool's safety and you understand the implications. Numerous programs claim to decrypt SD cards, but many are scams or malware. Exercise extreme caution. Only download tools from reputable sources and make sure they're compatible with your computer's operating system and the SD card's file system, likely FAT32 or XFAT. 4. Android's built-in decryption, if applicable. If the original phone was an Android device that used Android's built-in encryption, and you know the PIN or password used to lock the phone, there's a possibility that you might be able to decrypt it on a different Android device. Connect the SD card to the new phone and check for prompts requesting a password. However, success is not guaranteed. Remember that if you don't have the correct credentials, you might not be able to access the SD card. 5. Data recovery, last resort. If all else fails, you might consider professional data recovery services. These services possess specialized tools and techniques to potentially retrieve data from encrypted storage, even if the encryption key is lost. However, this is often expensive and doesn't guarantee success. It's usually a last resort after exhausting all other options. 6. Important security note. Attempting to decrypt an SD card without proper authorization or the correct decryption key is illegal in many jurisdictions. Always respect data privacy and the intellectual property of others. Remember, the chances of successful decryption dramatically decrease if you don't know the encryption method and the password or PIN. Before attempting any decryption, back up all your data. You could lose it in the process.